I'm aged only 17 years. For the first time, I required this certificate of OBC when I appeared for IIT examination. So my prayer is because the examination is scheduled tomorrow. My prayer is that subject to final decision of the case, I should be treated as OBC category. That is my humble request because once the examination is over, then it will create many problems. So subject to I. That is in the pleadings. That, that. But the matter is very urgent in nature because the petitioner appeared in the JE mains examination for getting entrance in the IITs, my lord. This is the second round of litigation. I draw my lord's kind attention to page 22. Because I'll reflect that because the matter was pending, therefore the OBC certificate was not given by the authorities. So at page number 22, in P3 may kindly be seen. The same petitioner came before this honorable court. Mm -hmm. And on 27 January 2023, mm -hmm. my lords passed the following order. Learned counsel for the petitioner contends that being agreed by the rejection of his application by order dated so and so, the petitioner has preferred an appeal before the collector, Narsingpur. Learned counsel for the petitioner contends that appropriate direction be issued to the collector, Narsingpur, to take a decision on the petitioner's appeal. As an appeal is already pending, this appeal was regarding the certificate of OBC, which they were not issuing. Mm. So, as an appeal is already pending before the collector Narsingpur, mm. in which challenge is to the order dated 12 12 2022, mm. the present petition stands disposed of with the direction to the collector Narsingpur to take a final decision on the appeal preferred by the petitioner by passing a well reasoned and speaking order as expeditiously as possible, preferably by 2020. Mm -hmm. Then, an extra P4, uh, page 24, an P4 was passed that I am an OBC, that is dated 23 to 2023. This certificate was issued by the authorities concerned after the order of the High Court that I am an OBC. So, the date is mentioned is 23 to 2023. Now, Malad, the entire position is that as far as my form was concerned, my form was filled before when this matter was pending before the High Court mm -hmm. and when the OBC certificate was not issued to me. Mm -hmm. I filled the form on 4th January 2023. Admittedly, at that particular time, OBC certificate was not in my possession. So, I went to pillar and post. I went to the authorities concerned. When the authorities did not hear it, I came to this honorable court. On 27 January, this honorable court passed the following order. So after that, they have issued me an OBC certificate. So my entire request is, my entire prayer is that now, when the certificate has been issued, I should be treated as OBC category candidate, not as a general category candidate. When you have delayed in issuing the certificate, there was no negligence on my part. I was requesting you again and again, again and again, that I belong to the OBC category. For the first time, I am aged only 17 years. For the first time, I required this certificate of OBC when I appeared for IIT examination. So my prayer is because the examination is scheduled tomorrow. My prayer is that subject to final decision of the case, I should be treated as OBC category. That is my humble request. Because once the examination is over, then it will create many problems. So subject to, I honestly say, it may be written in the order sheet, subject to final decision of the case, I should be treated as OBC category by the respondents. That is my humble request. I have received the acknowledgement. We have supplied the copy without that, they cannot even take the file. Mail. Office objection comes, Mallard. Because tomorrow is an examination, therefore, I am requesting that an interim order may be passed stating therein that because now he has received the OBC certificate. Because nowadays, nowadays the list, my lord, because now I'm just, I'm just submitting. Nowadays, because of the online system, immediately merit list is prepared of OBC different, general category different. That's why I'm praying. Result immediately, it can come day after tomorrow. Ajata. Ajata. IIT. Because it's a very small result 
and immediately they prepare a list of two categories so i am just making a request that subject to the final decision of the case i may be treated as obc category because now the authorities the date itself mentions after the high court order that is 23 do so it cannot be said that at particular time i have not submitted because you have not issued me the certificate when you have not issued me the certificate how can i claim to be an obc category रजिस्ट्रेशन इज एट पेज नंबर ट्वेंटी स्कोर कार्ड इज एट पेज नंबर पी टू एडमिट कार्ड इज पेज ट्वेंटी वन इट इज स्कोर कार्ड इट इज द स्कोर कार्ड एडमिट कार्ड दे हैव इशूड ओनली मतलब दे हैव इशूड ओनली डे फॉर यस्टरडे मतलब नॉट आई एम जस्ट शूइंग द एडमिट कार्ड बताइए दिस इज़ द एडमिट कार्ड इफ मैलोट वांट्स टू शो आपके ये एनिफ्टे पी टू देखिए आप इसमें कैटेगरी तो ओबीसी नहीं की आपकी नो मैलोट दैट इज़ द सेकंड बिकॉज़ देयर आर टू टाइप ऑफ़ पेपर्स इन द सेकंड पेपर वी हैव बिल्ड ये ये कब हुआ था ये ये जनवरी का ही है कब का ही नो नो दिस दिस शो इसमें ओबीसी कैटेगरी आपकी विच पेपर माय लॉर्ड इज आस्किंग तो क्या ओबीसी तो जनरल कैटेगरी हो जाएगी माय लॉर्ड व्हिच माय लॉर्ड इज आस्किंग रिगार्डिंग पेज 21 या दिस इज माय लॉर्ड रिगार्डिंग द सेकंड पेपर दिस इज जेई मेंस 2023 पेपर 1 हियर इट बिकॉज़ ऑफ सेशन 2 इट इज स्कोर कार्ड सेशन 2 वी हैव मेंशनड ओबीसी एनसीएल बट जस्ट सी द इंप्यूर ऑर्डर इफ माय लॉर्ड आई वांट टू मेक इट क्लियर जस्ट सी माय लॉर्ड द लास्ट पेज ऑफ द इनेक्शन व्हिच आई हैव फाइल्ड इट शोस This is dated 6 May 2023, page 27, P7. Uh, dear, refer to the clause so and so, page number eight of the information bulletin. According to this clause, the category of a candidate which will be made available by GE Apex Board, which conducts the examination, will be final and shall remain the same. Request for change of category will not be entertained. Hmm. So they have passed the impure order in writing through you, email. You are already categorized as OBC. No, my lord, this. There are two type of papers. Hmm. One is score one, score hmm. one card, which is an extra P one. Hmm. Other is score two. Hmm. Score two, it is it's it's for the candidate to apply again for better marks. So as far as first is concerned, if my lord will see page twenty, it is general. It is general. Hmm. They have treated me as general. Hmm. Then they have uh, 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 P two again. It is general. That is the paper one scorecard. P two is uh, okay. O B C N C L. No, my lord. P two is if my lord will see uh, page number twenty one. Did you see? Page number P two, page twenty one. Hmm. That is a uh, second is my lord is seeing the legible copy where it is written O B C N C L. That O B C N C L is regarding second. That's why if my lord will see there is no marks in session one. Just see the two papers, my lord. In the at page P two P two page twenty one, the first. That is, my lord is saying physics ninety nine, chemistry ninety nine point nine three, mathematics ninety nine point eight six, total ninety nine point nine zero. Above that is written general category. So these are the scorecards of the first score. Now for the second score, when I appeared, they mentioned because I mentioned OBC, so they de declared it nil nil not applicable because now you cannot change. Therefore, there is no score in the second paper. that is the entire problem which i i have submitted that as far as second is concerned once i make make a mention now that i am obc they treat me as nil 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 because according to them once you have given general category now you cannot make upgradation as an obc or a change as an obc that's why no marks have been written in it zero marks in all the things because it is non applicable according to them P two and P twenty. Paper one. 
एक एक दोनों ही एनटीए स्कोर पेपर वन भी पेपर वन है इन वन दोनों इन वन इन वन इन वन व्हेन आई हैव अपीयर्ड एज अ जनरल कैटेगरी दे गिव अस द स्कोर ऑफ इन सेशन वन एज 99.00 सो एंड सो सेशन टू एनी नाउ इन अगेन व्हेन आई अपीयर्ड एज अ ओबीसी कैटेगरी फॉर सेशन टू this this session 2 should have reflected the marks hmm. they are saying na not applicable not applicable not applicable meaning thereby that we will not treat you as obc category so a student who is scoring 90 uh, 99.90 marks he according to them is neither now a general category nor an obc category so he will be neither in any of the categories so that's why i'm making a uh, honorable prayer that i'll not claim any equity <laughs> okay or will you pass but my only respect to submission at the cost of repetition that because examination is tomorrow mm -hmm. i will not claim any equity this may be stated in the audit card there is admit card admit card my lord i've just shown it to my lords अभी दिया तो नहीं दिया आपने लोट अभी वाइल आई वाज आर्गुइंग आई गेव इट तू माय लोट सी डेट इज़ द एड दिस वाज इ शूट नहीं इसमें डेट ऑफ़ एग्जाम इसमें इकतीस एक 2023 इकतीस एक 2023 पढ़ी आप टाइम खराब कर रहा है भाई नहीं नहीं माय लोट माय लोट डेट इज़ इन द प्लीडिंग्स दिस इसमें ल but if my lord permits it's available on the internet it's available on the internet fourth this there's no question of misguiding my lord because date of the exam i i agree my lord because as far as this paper is concerned it was changed updated to fourth twice it has been changed but now it is fourth result kab aayega iska result can come any day after the evening or at 5 o'clock after there is no those there is no those there is no fixed date it can come any day when they prepare it and because it's an online procedure after one month after one month no 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 generally generally because it's a all on online therefore the result is prepared in the evening and it comes next day or by the midnight इसी एग्जाम हुए थे कब रिजल्ट आया था मतलब आईआईटी के एग्जामिनेशन के रिजल्ट्स कहीं अपन देखें तो आईआईटी के एग्जामिनेशन के रिजल्ट्स नेक्स्ट डे 100 परसेंट जाते हैं रात के 12 बजे तक और कहीं नेक्स्ट डे नहीं आते तो 48 आस में जाते हैं दिस कैन बी रिकॉर्डेड इन माय आर्गुमेंट्स